Number two is attention. Okay, so right now, you know, people, they're in their house. Um, they're in their house. They're stuck. And ultimately, what are a lot of people going to be doing, right? They're going to be on Facebook, just like you are on Facebook right now, okay? And people are just, are, people are going to be more on Facebook. Like, I would say that people are on quarantine, right? Their screen time is going to go way up because they're going to be on Facebook more often. They're just going to be like, maybe goofing off more than they would if they were in their house, I guess is maybe a better way to say it, right? Or excuse me, if they were in their office, you know, they might be like way more work focused, but if they're at home, maybe they're not going to be as focused on work. So you're going to have more attention on Facebook. Okay. So how can you leverage that attention? Well, number one, you could go live on Facebook and you could talk to people, right? I've, there's 41 people right now on this particular live that I'm, that I'm doing right this second. So I'm getting a chance to communicate, right? I'm, I'm, the attention is there. I'm demonstrating the fact that there's attention. You're watching this video because I'm creating value. You can create value for your network, okay? So think about that. What value can you create? Maybe you go look up some, some blog posts about 10 ways to entertain your kids in a snowstorm or something, right? Look for creative ways to do stuff with people when you're at your house, and you're stuck. People aren't used to that, right? Especially people that don't homeschool. We homeschool my son, so it's not as big of a deal for us when he's here all the time. But, you know, if you're not used to that, you have the kids in the house, then look for some ideas. You could be sharing that out with people, right? You could be creating value. Definitely go live on the personal page unless you want to run it as an ad. Okay, If you want to run it as an ad, then go live on your business page, otherwise personal page for sure. Okay, so Facebook Lives would be number one. Give people ideas, come here, share some stories, right? There's different ways that you can leverage the lives, but you know, people wanna see this kind of stuff. They're, they're on Facebook, they're gonna be on Facebook more often than they normally are when they're at their office if they're on quarantine, okay? If they're on some sort of a lockdown. What's up, Craig? What's up, Arlene? Appreciate you guys for tuning in. Okay, so consider going live and doing FAQs, telling, you know, these kind of things, right? Any, um, you know, just leveraging that attention, okay? Now, Okay, number two is tell some stories, okay? Everybody loves to hear stories, all right? This kind of blends in with the next idea I'm going to give you, but the stories, everybody loves to hear a story, you know? And especially if you can give some sort of, at the end, you have some kind of tie down where it actually matters, you know, why did they listen to your story, right? You don't want to just waste somebody's time telling a story that you love to tell, but it needs to have some sort of tie-in at the end. You need to have a reason why you're telling that story and you're not just simply wasting, you know, wasting your time. Um, and then, you know, for the third thing on attention is that you want to uh, basically, like you can ask, you can ask engaging questions, right? So again, people are on Facebook. They want to be engaging. They want to be talking to different people. So you can be creating that conversation on your profile, right? Kind of on your TV channel. A lot of ways I think about the Facebook profiles, like a TV channel, you know, people are coming over and they're scrolling through the networks or whatever, get them on your channel, okay? So be asking some questions. It also moves your profile up, right? It trends your profile um, when, when you have, everybody's engaging with your profile. So it tells Facebook you're popular. So then if you come later and talk about your business, more people are seeing that, right? Um, you know, we like inside the Legion of Loan Officers, we call that the edge rank slingshot, right? If you like these kind of concepts, the stuff I'm talking about now, you should check out oneagentaway.com and see exactly you know, how we're doing this kind of stuff inside of the Legion.